Like, uh, so here we go. I'd to the tune of Happy Birthday, right? Why you yeah. always lying? Like, Happy Birthday, by the way, is public domain. Don't don't let the people mess you up. That's public domain. Anyway, go ahead. What were you saying? Um, I wonder how often Ferris Fair paint gets used. Never. Uh, oh, they started. Ah, here we go. <laughs> Hello, everyone. My name is Dio Morales, your host of the Gold Squadron Podcast. We're coming to you live from our third and maybe final game of the night, especially after the computer crashing. If you were there live, you know what we're talking about. If you're not here live, join us on Twitch every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday. Right now is a Saturday night when we're uh, we're recording this, so... Looking forward to seeing you here in the chat. Come, let's talk about X-Wing. Let me know what your favorite ship is, and let's just have a good time. My co-host for today is James Ritter. How's it going, James? Hello, everyone, and good morning. That's that's right. Good morning in in the you're in the UK, right? Yes. Crazy person and, and living on the other side of the planet. Who I'm talking to? It's <laughs> super weird. Man, I, I, I got I got I got I got to break break the fourth wall here for a second. Like I. I sometimes just sit down and and just think about the fact, like if I would have if I go back, you know, twenty years and talk to my 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 thirteen year old self, I'm like, hey, listen, listen, invest in Zoom. <laughs> Number one, <laughs> teleconferencing. Number two, okay, just have these supplies. But also, you're gonna get to. You're going to get to talk to people all around the world. You're going to get to know people from all around the world because of a board game. It's pretty awesome. I know that you, you're a sad person right now, but you're going to not be sad later on. It's going to get better. Things are going to get better, man. Okay? Like, I wouldn't I wouldn't believe myself. So, if, if I've met you in person or we've talked in the chat, we've talked via YouTube comments or through Discord, through Twitch chat... It is amazing to get to know you guys, so thank you so much. Anyway, back to the game. Today is randomly generated day. Players got to choose from one of 14 randomly generated lists. I generated those lists using the yet another squad builder, squad randomizer. Thank you to Rathos out there. He actually tagged me in chat and said, when are you going to invite me to fight Flight Club? When you respond to the Flight Club notifications is the answer. There are rules. There are rules to Flight <laughs> Club. Uh, talk about Flight Club is number one, always. Uh, by the way, two lists for each faction were generated to keep it nice and fair. And uh, what ended up happening is we had each player pick two, spawn them, Look at one, pick one, the other one goes in the trash. We actually got only two left over. And uh, if this game goes up quickly in flames, we'll play a, th a fourth game for you guys tonight. But we'll we'll see. At the minimum, we'll go ahead and show off what they were. By the way, uh, shout out to Crazy Vulcan as this <laughs> this format was his idea. Sim doing them on, on TTS, using the discs and all that, uh, his idea. So shout out to Crazy Vulcan for that. Um, I noticed that our timer isn't going, so I'm going to go ahead and get that fixed as we continue to play here. James, what are the lists? What are the lists indeed? All right, so for Gabo, we have a scum list with Namlum, Jamming Beam, Ketsu Anyo, and Bosk. So really a mixed bag there and not a lot of helpful stuff, <laughs> so, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, next up, we have a Shadow Point uh, Shadow Port Hunter with Informant. So that is just a, uh, a a decent platform that Lancer class pursuit craft. Not a, a lot of people sleep on it, but it really is a three die gun with a two die turret, two agility, and ten health. So it it it's a uh, it can do some work. Uh, next up, we have Captain Nim with just concussion bombs. So usually you like to see Captain Nim outfitted with a bit more bombs, trajectory sim, but uh, keeping it light here in this random build. So uh, we'll see how those concussion bombs go. And oh. last up is Torkoal Mux. Uh, no moldy crow, so can only use his ability in a one arc. Sad. 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 You know what? That ability is awesome. Being able to drop somebody to yeah. to initiative zero in the uh, engagement phase. Yeah, I'm there's in. only one ship. In, there's only one ship in the game that I want to get rid of, and uh, it's Torkoal. So, <laughs> uh, <laughs> show me on the doll where Torkoal hurts you, please. <laughs> Everywhere, <laughs> all over it. <laughs> Every, I, I've I've never won a single game against Torkoal. Uh, Torkoal Swarm. 
Oh, sad. I man. lose, and I have a I have a friend at uh, our local game store that plays it like religiously all so. the time. So you <laughs> yeah. just, just been beat over the head <laughs> with Torkoal mugs. Yeah. All right, but a uh, pretty uh, pretty interesting kind of squad over there. Uh, but uh, across the table is Gerardo. Did I say that right? Yeah, that works. All right, close enough. Um, with uh, with a resistance squad, with a Vi Marathi, with PZ for C zero, uh, the droid that lets you pass calculates or focuses, uh, Tally, with concussion missiles, prime thrusters, prime thrusters, and Ben Teen, uh, and the Star Fortress with concussion bombs, ion bombs, and delayed fuses, and then finally we have. Pamich Nero Good with and the resistance transport with ferrosphere paint, jamming beam, advanced proton torpedoes, and seasoned navigator. So uh, trying to fit as many uh, <laughs> as many uh, conditions on this game as we can. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so uh, Vi Marathi has that compromising intel, which lets her look at an opponent's dial. Um. At range zero to three of Marathi, and you cannot spend focus tokens when you defend or perform an attack against five Marathi. That's so, right. So that shadow very, port hunter cannot uh, can't do do yeah. as as much damage potentially. Okay, that that may be the reason why she chose to go on that one. It's just for the defensive and offensive portions of it. That's true. That's true. If you're trying to burn it down, I mean, the Shadow Port Hunter is actually the most expensive ship in Gabo's list, sitting at sixty points. Oh man, he's going yeah. for the he's going for the points. That's what it is every time. <laughs> it's all you ever uh, think about is the points. Yeah, and then uh, Benteen has that um, rattle condition. After you perform an attack, if the defender's in your mobile arc, assign the rattle condition to the defender. And rattled reads. After a bomb or mine at range zero to one detonates, suffer a damage. Then remove this card. Uh, you can get rid of rattled by spinning an action. And if there are no bombs or mines at range zero to one, so uh, how that works is Benteen performs an attack as long as the at a defender is in the mobile arc. He can assign the rattled. Then if you uh, suffer the damages, or if you suffer after a bomber mine detonates at range zero to one, uh, if you have that rattle condition, you take an additional damage. So um, could pay off possibly. Um, I'd be very interested to see it if it does. It's as a lot of work to be do to be done without a trajectory simulator to help you. It sure is. Now, uh, one thing I want to just talk about here is seeing the uh, seeing an A wing without advanced optics. Real weird. We got prime thrusters out there. While you have two or fewer stress tokens, you can perform barrel roll and boost actions even while stressed. I'm curious to see if that actually uh, matters in the game. It's... Uh, sh she could focus, rotate, boost. Uh, fuck. No. Well, are you? Are you, what? You're yeah. right. You're right. Yeah. You I sure know. I'm right. Get out of here. <laughs> I know. But I mean, that's so weird. It's super weird, though. Yeah. It's, it's just like you get the, too stressed. Um, but that. Yeah. You're right. Because it's it's chaining the refined gyro stabilizers, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's it's like um, uh, what's his name does this a lot. Uh, Kylo Ren with the uh, prime thrusters. Mm-hmm. Uh, he's able to do that, like focus boost barrel roll, or target lock boost barrel roll. But isn't it, isn't there a rule though where you can only activate? There's like a once per opportunity rule. Um, no, you can keep adding it to the queue. After um, you perform an action, you may perform a red uh, boost or a red port, uh, rotate. So after you perform an action, which would be your focus. It gets added to the queue, and then when you perform your red rotate, it gets added mm -hmm. to the queue again, and then you perform the red boost, and it gets added to the queue again, but you can't do the boost again, so there's nothing that you can really do. You're the only reason that... Yeah. The only, the only reason that you can't do it a lot 
um, is with uh, yeah, they are talking about. He is talking about linked actions. Uh, yeah, is that, is that is that what's in my brain? Yeah. All right. Yeah, yeah. Someone had like linked, like I don't know, like it, you can't do multiple linked, and you can't linked off of a linked, and yeah. Basically, whatever would be really cool if you to do if you could do it with a linked action, you can't do it. Cool. <laughs> is is how I read that. The new <laughs> All right, well, I'm going to hide my face from here, and uh, we'll get focused on the game because we're about to get engagement. Pew, pew, pew. So it looks like Nam Lum took a lock on Benteen. That's right. By the way, bets are open for the next, like, 45 seconds. Get them in. Now, I hope, uh, I hope Gobble remembers that he yep. doesn't have a front arc. I was about to say the same thing. I was like, I really hope that he knows that... Okay, he's rotating it. Oh, uh, there's a rotate. Okay, we got it. Like, We're fine. We're fine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because like that's how you usually play Torkoal is skirt the outside with one arc, with your arc, uh, your mobile arc pointed on the inward. Exactly. All, All right. right. Shadowport Hunter taking a turn here. Now, the Shadowport Hunter does have a mobile arc. It is currently pointed to the right side, but should have that front arc. Uh, pointing at Vibarati, but, but we're gonna see we're gonna see compromise intel guys the intel uh, He just says no, I won't do that and I'll take a lock instead because I can spend locks <laughs> It's like actually no nah. Yeah, he just so, can't spend never mind. He remembered he read the cards Sad. Ooh, going for a lock on Tally, not Vi. I'm surprised about that. Yeah, take take it where you can, where you know you're gonna get it. But Tally could definitely have three bank left and uh, sit right in front of the <laughs> range one of the Shadowport Hunter. Now Ben, moving forward, mm -hmm. could potentially give the rattled condition to Namlom because Namlom's is in the side arc. And he's in the front arc, so he can That's do right. that with a three die shot. Both. Why not both? That's right. And a reminder: the rattle condition after a bomb or mine at range zero to one detonates, suffer one crit. You're just gonna need to put it on the screen because no one's gonna remember that. Oh, you're you're right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Pamich moving up. Um, a ship that we don't see very often, uh, one of the resistance transports. While you have two or fewer stress tokens, you, you may execute red maneuvers while even while stressed. So uh, on the onset, that doesn't look very good. Uh, but actually, when you tie it together with Season Navigator, mm -hmm. um, that's pretty interesting because you can actually, like, that basically makes your entire dial red. So... Um, you'd like to see that with Corsella as well to get rid of all those stress tokens. Yep. Uh, but that's an interesting build that um, we don't see very often. Well, completely random. Uh, yeah. Go, go luck. <laughs> yeah, that's that's actually pretty decent though. Like season navigator, Corsella, um, and then yeah, like a like a cannon, and just be like a coordinating machine. I mean, it's not good, but I think uh, the other ship does it better. Who's the uh, Who's the other transport? Kova. Not Kova. Everyone knows Kova. <laughs> I mean, that's a good one. <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's right. another one. There's another one that has like messages of stress. Um, I'm not a uh, Noden. Noden. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, Deslin Nine. Oh. Chat. Chat is the best. Yep. I mean, when you have like a hundred brains thinking about it, somebody's going to have it on the, on the tip of their tongue. So someone plays resistance in here. That's right. All right. So you had uh, Captain Nim rolling forward to catch uh, Ben Tina Nark. That's right. Ben. Star Fortress about to last Jedi here. Yeah. Ben, release the bombs. Release the bombs. Just drop them. Just <laughs> All right. Uh, I think we're gonna see a focus boost here. Or... Ooh, could I get a lock to get the concussion missile off. I think a focus boost though uh, gets mm. you Tally's ability. 
Yep. Uh, I, I like I like the focus boost right now, and it gives you the the range one shot. Cause I'm not sure if at the angle tally has a range one. Focus. Are we gonna get the boost? Boost. Hmm. No. Just the focus. So he's going through his options. Yep, just the focus. No stress. Oh, he's bringing down Benteen to uh, I zero with Torkoal Mux ability. All right, Ben does not get to shoot. That also means that he's going to be forced to spend that focus at some point. Won't have it available for offense, most likely. First shot, three on two. Important thing to note about Benteen's ability, though, is that uh, you don't have to hit to sign the rattle condition. This is true. You just gotta just gotta be there. All right, one hit. Two evade dice. One squiggle. I gotta be honest. I actually really don't like the white dice. <laughs> just, just looking, they, it's 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 really it's really bright. I don't. I have my eyes. I don't know. It hurts my eyes. It does. Sound like a little baby. <laughs> Who was saying that you were complaining too much earlier? Ah, uh, somebody. Oh, what, we were talking about the fly better. That's right. The... <laughs> oh, you just did it again. You just did it again. <laughs> Alrighty. The partnership. The partnership, that's right. Uh, you don't spend here, I think, on tally. No. Oh, uh, I think you go after Shadow Court Hunter here. Where you have the most shots and where you're most likely to hit. Yeah. Focus fire. Focus fire is part of the game. Get he it. does have a he does have a lock on the um, Shadowport Hunter, but I think you would want to save that for your advanced proton torpedo. Yes, yeah, you know, you just you just roll roll the natties, see what you get. Oh, it's getting a little greedy, getting a little greedy going at Nim. Just shooting through the cloud here with no mods is very doubtful to do damage. One hit. Oh, maybe a. Hey, wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute, James. This this could be a bamboozle. Don't bamboozle me. No, dude, dude, look, look, look. He's like, oh, look, I'm paying attention to Nim over here. I'm going to go get Nim. And then Pamich turns in and go like, ah, got you, Shadowport. Advanced Proton in the face. You know what I mean? Like, maybe he's, he's a little bit of a deception yeah, maybe. here, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Ugh. That's a... But I feel like you do that with, like, positioning more than you do with shooting hey 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 it's a psychological game x-wing yeah. is a game of mental positioning okay mental positioning <laughs> all right uh let me torkoal coming in uh probably spins here i think yeah i mean you're going full offense you brought the you brought the heat you In the roll after one hit, got the squiggle. Yeah. Ben looking strong right now. Ben 10. I know it's teen. It's more fun to say Ben 10. There's a copyright somewhere in there. Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right. The Shadow Four Hunter, three die attack with a lot on to tally. One crit only. Oh my goodness. Gobble on the underside of these rolls here. 
Spends a lock. Ooh. There it is. Hit, hit, crit. All right. Tally could definitely be hurting here. Uh, gonna That's take spent. a shield after spinning a focus. Yep. Mm. Not 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 a place to uh, to be like. Ah, I'll take it. <laughs> no <laughs> big, no. no big, no big. Oh, that would that would be the cockiest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> it's like ah, that's fine. All right, uh, and here comes Nam Lum. Uh, I assume that you just shoot the primary here. And got two. Oh, wow. Pop, pop. So definitely doing A damage. Um, I don't think you spend. Uh, you made it this far. Yep, taking the two shields. I mean, at this point, you should have. He, he he should have lost more. So I think you're right. You just hold on to it and you you roundhouse kick uh, Torkoal yeah. Mux right here. Yeah, you lean in. I think. It's your best Chuck Norris impression right now. Oh no! Don't use that. Don't use that one. Yeah, yeah. He don't don't lean into rattled. Rattled is trash. It's fine. Yeah, don't, don't don't do no, it. Don't. Fire at Torkoal. 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 Or or Nim. Torkoal is the way. No! What? Why would you no, not wait, fire why is he using the... Oh, goodness. I, he, he's What's leaning up? into the ability, but I think he's misunderstanding the ability. Yeah. I, I kind of want to say something, because he can shoot with the front. Uh, do I? Do I? Ah, chat! I, no, I, I just feel like this I, is misreading the card. I'm going to do it. Hey. Okay. Hey. You can roll one more die. You don't have to attack with side arc to apply with apply uh, condition. Just needs to be in it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, they just add one more. All right, we did it. We did it. It was the right thing to do. Yeah. It, it was. It was obvious confusion with the with the ability. Yeah, that's that's fair. As seeing, it's like no one's ever played that before. There it is. Three. And I think that actually makes it range. I think it was range three before, was it not? Was it? No, I'm low. no, no, I'm at range two. All the conditions. Yeah, I think I think leaning into the ability is not great. I mean, we we, we are creatures of of look at that look at that cool shiny trick I've never done. I want to do that again, or I want to do that for the first time. Gerardo just wants to be the hero that brought us a trigger of the of the rattled condition. Can you blame him? Can you really blame I mean, him? No, I can't. It would That's literally be, it would be a gold squadron first. Ah. A gold uh, squadron first. Looks like Vi did not shoot. And then they, they're picking it up. They're scooping it up. We good. We good. All right. Two, two, no, no. two hits. And two shields off on Shadowport Hunter. Shields down. Watch out, Vi Marathi, <laughs> resistance hero. Excuse me. 
Ooh. Bless you. Excuse me. <laughs> Got the Rona. Oh, no, don't say that <laughs> shit. I'm a teacher, man. I, that's that's like that's what we. That's the one thing I I I like. So... Thanks. <laughs> you can't do. It. <laughs> I can't. It's all right. My my wife works in uh, childcare, and uh, like they, she, there's like three facilities on base here, mm -hmm. and, and like one of the facilities is uh, has like five cases lately. Yep. And uh, they're like trying to combine the facilities now. Yeah. Like, why would you combine them if they just had a case? That <laughs> doesn't make any sense. Because that's how math works. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Um, I'm sorry. I did. I did. Uh, I did. I did say I said a no-no word there. Sorry to any any younger viewers. I'm sorry, parents. My bad. Um. <clears throat> So Vi is not in a great spot because of like she had to hop skip over Tally. Yep. So maybe oh, just, just hop skip over her again. Just keep keep the hopscotch going. <laughs> I think that 3k. Yeah, I like the 3k because you either block the shadow port hunter or it'll just end up blocking you. And then yeah. And then you use your little pod as a blocker while Tally starts chewing Ooh. up the backside. But shadow port hunter could 5k. <laughs> That would be strong. Yeah. I call your K turn and raise you a K turn. Yeah, but mine's two more. That's right. <laughs> I have the bigger stick. Uh, all right. I don't think we see a bomb this turn, but if we did, probably concussion fuse. Uh, concussion fused. I like it. Do they have three hearts? I doubt it. The the Star Fortress? No, no. Let they me can't. Dream. They can't. Let me let me dream. <laughs> um, too, too hard, hard might. I think too hard left might not be bad. That way you set up. It's like for them to like start following you and you drop bombs. Or three bank if that if they have that. <laughs> I'd like to launch a formal apology to the Lim household. We're on two strikes. I didn't, I didn't even hear you. That's right. It never happened. Yeah. <laughs> It happened very I'm quickly. I'm really confused. I, I thought you said. Yeah, I have no idea what you said. <laughs> <laughs> that's how. That's how. Um, it happened so fast. That's how uh, desensitized I am. <laughs> desensitized. Oh, you need a hug. All right. Trigger happy taco. What did you miss? You have missed this. Uh, these ridiculous lists. That uh, that we've been playing again. If somebody, let's say you're watching in the future and you're just jumping around this YouTube video, I want to remind you that today was randomly generated squad day. Players chose from one of 14 randomly generated lists. We have two left over uh, because as they've been picked, uh, we've been taking them out of the circulation. But uh, it's been been super fun. I love I love how my wife sends me a text message and says ice cream question mark or a question mark or no, nah. like who's gonna say no to ice cream, like a, res a responsible adult. Right. I mean, you're right. You're right. But I mean, that makes me that that, that makes me the bad guy, right? If I'm like, like no 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 ice cream, nah. Why why would I ice cream? Why would I do that? Why 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 would I do that? Hmm. Yeah, it's hard to say no to ice cream. Mm. Uh, is it Bluebell? It is, it is not. Oh, I miss Bluebell. <sighs> hmm. 
All right, so yeah, here's that 5k from the Shadowport Hunter, but way too early. I think there's some I ones, aren't there? Oh no, he's flipping it up because of uh, oh, Vimarati. Vimarati. I feel like we should have a Gold Squadron ice cream party one day on Zoom. Zoom ice cream party. Is Nim dropping right. a bomb? Yeah, she's dropping a concussion bomb. Nice. Remember, Which Nim is... can hold it. Nim's ability able to prevent bombs from detonating. It's pretty pretty swanky ability. That's interesting, but like now it sets her up to like now she has to drop the rest of them. No, you just reload. Don't these things have reload? No, they don't have reload. Oh, garbage, trash. I don't. I don't know how. Like it's this is Skurg H six bomber. No reload action. You know why? Honestly, honestly, I think it's still because, it's still in. Nim. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> because name, it's still in in first edition timeout in design. Yeah. It was in first edition timeout. I was like, should we give him reload? Like, <laughs> the designer like, no. People hated this ship. Do you remember? Do you remember? The dark times. I love, I love the, the you know, I love you guys, newbie second edition players who just started in. in <laughs> in second edition but like when when i hear a, a second edition only player say something like why why do so many people uh hate miranda and <laughs> the, the chat or discord just going crazy like you don't like, remember what she did to us you don't remember like vietnam like flashbacks that's right <laughs> I'm, I'm one of those people though i started in second edition Yeah, <clears throat> actually, actually, I had one first edition tournament, uh, and I think I played like, uh, what is it, Ray and like Poe or something, and uh, yeah, that was absolutely terrible. <laughs> um, or I, I've seen a thread also when somebody describes twin laser turret. <laughs> and and then a, a second edition player only goes, that doesn't sound too bad. I'm like, ah, oh, no. Because <laughs> it was basically like take two damage, right? I mean, it was at least take a damage a turn. It was attack. All right, cool. And no matter what, attack again. And it was a range two to three turret bubble, 360 degrees. Yeah. Yeah. No, too good. Too good. Right, we have rising hero trolling here. It's just one damage, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Man, if if Din if uh if Benteen did do that two or three bank left, I think I get some out of both arcs there. And it sets him up for some sweet bombs. Bomb, 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 bombs. Oh, did did Ben not drop any bombs? No. Oh my goodness. Sad. Sad. Uh, all right. So probably gonna get a bump on Nim here, but is definitely taking a shot from Torkel and not being able to shoot him out of the front arc. Raytheos saying that he doesn't think TLT would have been a big deal if the second shot was conditional on missing the first. I mean, in in oh, the wow, I I, I still dis I still disagree. But uh, I mean, it would have been less bad. But anyway, five, we got a five k from Tally. When do you see A Wings five k? This what man is, is crazy. This? He's a madman. He's a madman. I, and I, I didn't love even really it. Have red maneuvers. <laughs> It's like I, I, thought, race, I, thought, I, I, I call your 5k. But he, here's an interesting interesting situation here though. You know, he did serve up the uh the Vimarati's just sitting there real nice at what looks like probably range one. 
Or do you take yeah. advantage of the A wing being stressed? Yeah, that's. Oh, he could have boosted. Choice. He could have boosted. He's got prime <gasps> thrusters. He could have uh, boosted. Ah. Yeah. What but is happening right now? Th but then, if you're at range one of that thing, you probably don't want to do that. Did something get deleted? No. Oh, okay. Yeah. PZ, at the end of activation, you may choose one friendly ship at range one to two. If you do calculate one transfer token to, uh, what to calculate token? If... Oh my goodness. Okay. All right. Got that. Such a weird card. All right. Here we go. Pew pews. Again, a little bit of a missed opportunity there. I, I, but I know it happened with these random lists, the unexpected upgrades. You don't, you don't, they're usually the ones that throw you off or you miss. Even though that that one hurts just a little bit, uh, I don't know if the boost is that great though. Cause it puts him range one of the Shadowport Hunter. That's true. But it is unmodded, and he would get his extra defense die. Hit Oof. crit. Angry A-Wing. I don't need optics. What are optics? My eyes work fine. Oh. Natties. Oh, natties. Next shot coming in. We got Pamich firing at Nim range three. And it is through a cloud as well. One hit. Oh, Go. Natties trip again. Nats. And all these natties. <laughs> Gotta save some natties for the rainy day, man. Yeah. I hate that. I hate rolling uh, like great dice when I don't need them. You know, actually, that point is a great, uh, a great segue here. We'll, we'll talk about it in a little bit. Um, well, let's let's wait for these attacks here. We got a range one here. Torquil Mux, hit crit. Blank. That crit's going on the hole. Boom, boom. And Ben is taking a loose stabilizer. I mean, he probably wanted to stay still anyway. Mm-hmm. Well, I mean, if he, if, he, uh, if he stops, he's also going to take a damage. But yeah, if you oh, just yeah. do a one forward next turn and per tactical bump into Captain Nim, you essentially get the same thing. And here's a shadow port, range one going into Vi. Oh, oh, whiffs on the attack. Very unfortunate. Now those ships he on the bottom of the board refusing to do damage to each other. Just playing patty cake over here. Unable to use the front arc, just out there. Wait, what? He can still shoot at the side. Side can't arc. He? Side arc. Hello? I know the 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 Star Forge is a little bit weird. You know, has those double arcs. If you're not used to flying it, I think this is. The, oh, there it is. Hit crit. Not sure who the target is. We'll find out if they take damage. Uh, but Gobble will just roll natties again. It's fine. Almost. Oh, bomber is a zero. Got it. Got it. Well, then who just... I'm confused. He rolled two dice going at Pamich. That's what it was. Got it. Hmm. 
We are fine. Now we got the side arc shot. Mm, yeah, then the shield goes off Pamage. Yep. So Pamage should be at 5 2. Boom. Got it. We're fine. And hmm. there's a the range one going into Nom Lom. Nom 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 Lom Lom. Nom Lom Ding Dong. Two hits. One evade. Shields are down on Nom Lom. And Nom Lam rotates his arc. Because he has to. Box trigger! Um. Oh, okay. But he, he, he didn't miss, right? So it doesn't matter. Yeah. I just saw him ping Boss. I was like, Boss, what? Boss! I think it was maybe thinking Dengar. Hmm. Yeah, normally, yeah. <laughs> Not in the randomly generated jank tank inspired format. There can only be one, and that is Bosk. So he, here was the, the question I was going to bring up. Uh, James, you mentioned, you know, I hate when I roll good dice when I don't need them, right? Mm -hmm. So that is one of the things that a lot of people, I'm going to say forget when they look at their dice stats on Tabletop Simulator. Uh, is, you know, they'll just look at that number and they, they look at it in a vacuum, right? It doesn't have any context, which I think is, is always a, a problem, Um so it's, it's yeah. I find it really interesting. Like it doesn't, it also doesn't have any context when it comes to like, um, uh, like obstacles, right? Because on obstacles you want to roll blanks, right? Yeah. Want... <laughs> yeah. Like so that... I I, de I definitely take it with a grain of salt. Like uh, whenever I check die stats, um, uh huh. And I, and I try to keep it. Like I try to be objective when I look at them. Yep. Like because of stuff like rock rolls and. Uh, and damage uh, cards. Different damage cards, yeah, because you don't want to hit some of the stuff like that. Um, but I'll definitely check it. Like, uh, I'll I'll check it per periodically throughout throughout the game. Oh, I don't uh -huh. I don't like that. Don't ever do yeah, that. I, don't 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 do that against me. I find <laughs> it, I that? find it disrespectful. I'll fight you. Oh really? You spit you spit on you spit in my face. You check oh, those I dice results during the game. <laughs> I'll do it to be like, okay, like, am, am I being crazy or do I, I feel like I have rough dice right now? Like, yeah. um, or the other way around, like if I have really good dice, I'm like, okay, I feel like I'm, I need to be more careful with my positioning because if I'm relying a lot on dice right now. Uh, so, but yeah, it, it, it goes both ways. Yep. <clears throat> yeah. I'm not, not a huge, I'm just not a huge fan. I, here's, the yeah. thing, here's the thing, James. I didn't realize, I didn't realize how much I didn't like somebody like people checking dice stats during the game until it happened, and I was like, "Wow, I'm I find myself offended. I don't know why I am, but I don't know there's something something about like I I always I get a little irritated when people immediately like blame dice right so like somebody doing that is like somebody in the like if we're across the table from each other for me it's like oh dice oh dice but not giving me any credit like that's yeah. that's what that's like, what comes to my mind emotionally right away it's a really like you know, I, yeah i put it, my ships there to capitalize on it so ex exactly oh yeah I, de I definitely understand that like i get i get where you're coming from a rising oh, hero man. says, I had a person check it after every turn. Oh, oh, yuck. Yuck. Super triggered. Marcel, tell us how you feel. And that's, that's, that's how I feel. 
By the way, the point you brought up earlier, uh, Marcel, I think that will be a great discussion topic on the podcast. That's the only reason why I'm not repeating it. <laughs> what did he say? I have to know now. Nope, never. Well, you, you, you just have to tune in on Monday night. I, I can't stay up on a school night. <laughs> <laughs> You'll just have to re- rewatch the podcast on Tuesday morning. I listen and on my way to work. Listen on the way to work. There you go. <clears throat> all right. All right. So, uh, so revealing dials uh, mm-hmm. because of all of these uh, conditions. Yeah, we got listening like device Jeff. out there and the Vimerati trigger. And we're dropping another um, concussion because he has to. And uh, Ben Teen also dropping a concussion. So he's definitely going to be taking that. Might be taking two. No, oh, he might be taking, yeah. Might be taking, th- no, like, there's a possible to be three. Nah, no, no, yeah. Nah, whatever, make it three. <laughs> it's, it's more fun that way. Yeah, it's definitely possible, but there's no way for him to do it. Uh, so that rattle is going to go off. <gasps> oh, we're gonna get rattled! Oh my goodness! I feel like I des- like Gerardo should receive a prize. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna do it. Historic moment here, guys. We didn't even see rattled go off in first edition. Okay, we've been around Wait, for a while. First, <laughs> not even in first edition. Oh my goodness! Man. So Torkoal <laughs> flying away saying, I, I want nothing to do with that hot mess. Taking the focus, stresses uh, in order to do that linked action with the rotate. Hamich, one banking towards a Shadowport Hunter. Ugh, man. Not quite long enough to uh, to reach for that advanced Proton Torpedo. Yeah, thank, thank Yoshi in the chat just says, I just realized new ships come out in six days. Yes, six days. That's how, that's how you know <laughs> when we get real weird here on the podcast, you know that it's... Uh, Right before something something's dropping, it's like, uh, well, let's just wait. <laughs> yeah. By the way, next weekend, we will be live uh, from the Lima Open. So uh, make sure – I actually talked to Gobble today. If you're a player, okay, and you haven't – uh, followed his instructions. Uh, I, again, I'm not a, I'm not playing, so I don't know what they are. But I know he sent out emails. So please read his emails uh, from 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 one to to helping another. Please read the instructions, follow, so, and, and get stuff signed up for TTT, and get all get all that stuff solved, so that uh, the, the man the man can sleep the night before. He'd really appreciate it. And uh, thank Yoshi. I think you're 100 percent right. That is that is part of my part of my the, the theory I'm building my uh, my Charlie Day conspiracy board right now. <laughs> All right, Ben, taking a target lock on Torkel. Ooh. Nim, able to get out of that uh, concussion bomb. Get out. I mean, maybe. I think so. Sneaky, sneaky. Oh, zero. Initiative zero. Okay. 
So let's let's activate some bombs. Holding out the back one. Nim ability triggers the first one. Let's get that bubble. Yep. All right. So damage card on Ben. Will Ben take a strain? Hmm. Currently, is it all over? Uh, by the way, I don't know if you saw, but he did take that loose stabilizer and uh, took a damage for it. I did not. I did not. That's okay. what I was looking at. Yeah. So wait, why does he have seven? Uh, all right. So the bomb goes off. What are we waiting for? All right, takes a card. Taking the strain. There's a card. Down to six hull. And I believe that's half points right there. Gobble scoring 33. Ooh, Second no, card. Oh, get out of it. Oh, all right. Nim takes a damage. That's under the shields. So does Namlom. And then rattled. 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 Can we get a rattled in the chat, everybody? This is history. Yeah. Hopefully they remember. I'm gonna tell them. Because it's it's not a it's not a May. There you go. They they pinged it. Rattled! Woo! History! First rattled in history. So he's going to take two cards total. And the card's going to get removed. One's a crit. <laughs> oh, shoot. It's it, a crit. It's a crit, yeah. Oh, man. Ben, ben, ben teen meta. That's right. <laughs> They're probably looking it up. I just, I forgot to uh, type it out. Yeah. Cause I just copy paste it and it doesn't paste the, the symbols. What's in the box? <laughs> and it is a stunned pilot. And that means that Nomlom is down the four hall after the rattled condition. Very nice. So that could be tricky for Nomlom going through the next couple of uh, next couple of clouds, or next couple of, like he's he's moving into that debris field. Mm -hmm. So. All right. Uh, so we're gonna see. Uh, Nim could uh, put a ton of damage here into Ben Teen. Range one. No mods, though. Shields are down. Doesn't need them. Pop, pop, oh. pop, pop. <laughs> my heart. <laughs> Nim from the streets. Oh, my goodness. What is happening right now? All right. And uh, Benteen on, what is that, two hole remaining. And he is uh, Torkoal down to I-0. So if he gets killed this round, he won't be able to shoot. That is correct. Oh, my gosh. Catch me outside. That's right. 
Nims just trying to live up to his hot plastic GSP alt art. Yeah, I mean, that card came out awesome. It did. It came out really, really good. I actually have a plate paper one on my desk. It's right there. It looks really good. We have somebody with a, with a, a Twitch name, Ben, with a bunch of numbers after it. It's cheering on Ben, and it's sad. He's using the jamming beam here. Two hits. Wait, jamming beam? Who's using jamming beam? Uh, Hamage? Jay. All right. Oh, he broke the lock. Trying to save Vi. What is... Geraldo is a hero. He used jamming beam this game. Rattled condition. This is the spirit. This is the spirit of random squads. Oh, my goodness. I don't care who wins this game. Gerardo, you're a champion in my heart. <laughs> All right, here we go. It's Torkoal Mux. One hit. Here's the squiggles. Nothing. Hmm. He did not die this round. He's going to get to rattle somebody and drop a bomb this turn. Range one, shadow port unmodded now because of the jamming beam by Pamich. Yeah, we'll, we'll see if that two damage is worth it. Here we go. Oof. Uh, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, no. Nope, definitely nope. not worth it. That's the expected uh, result with the target lock. Ah. Uh, riggedy, riggedy, wrecked. Um, Down to one dice. hull. Three dice? Why? What? What? Who rolled three dice? Ah. Tally ability. Tally, ah, tally, tally. Yeah. Let's go ahead and update that. Boom, boom, boom. Nom, lom. Taking a shot at Pamich at the side arc. One crit. Uh, hit crit after focus. Oh, yes. Got the squiggle. Still taking a crit, though. Pamich has shields. We're fine. Here we go. Ben Teen, our hero. The Crimson Specialist. Nope. Frat Vigus first. Oh, false. Vi Marathi. By the way, uh, she's an awesome, awesome character from the books. Oh yeah. If you haven't haven't read those, they are fantastic. Yeah. She's just amazing. She appears in the Phasma book. She appears in the Black Spire Outpost book as well. Good, good stuff. Have you read the new Thrawn book yet? Uh, yes. Ooh, ooh. Hit, crit, crit. Vi throwing <laughs> hot fire. Uh, that, that is a squiggle. Oh. Yeah. Hit, crit still, though. That is past the shields. Yeah, the uh, the new, new Thrawn book came out. Uh, Ascendancy, uh, right? Uh, Structural yeah. damage. I think it's crit crit. Is it not? Oh, yeah, it is crit crit. You're right. Crit crit. Double crits. Crit crit. Pop pop. Council and structural damage. Um, yeah, ascendancy. I think the first one's chaos, I think. I have to look at my phone. I, I do them all in audiobooks. Yeah. Oh, in audiobooks? Yeah. Yeah. I do them on my Kindle. It's the only way I can I can get through books. That's a 
just because of time or a uh, little bit of time but also my reading skills are not super strong <laughs> uh, i'm just being honest just being honest uh there's yeah there's some stuff there but we don't gotta worry about that yeah throne ascendancy chaos rising yes i did read it that was the last one i think i got confused because in my in my queue for like auto buy is the the next ascendancy book the yeah. greater good I have it like that on one, a, so I've seen the cover a bunch for that one. Chaos Rising just came out, didn't it? It did. Yeah, dang, that's quick. I mean, this one, this the 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 next one, Greater Good isn't coming out until May, so yeah, May twenty twenty one. Yeah, I'm just surprised you've already like read all of Chaos Rising. Oh yeah, yeah, I, I burned through that. <laughs> Was it good? It, it, I I enjoyed it. Yeah, I'm a fan. Big fan. Yep. <laughs> yeah, all of the uh of these on books are great. Claudia Gray though is is my is my is my my book my Star Wars book unicorn. She's amazing. Hey Crit. Um, she's the one that did Lost Stars. Uh, yeah, Lost Stars. Safe. There's another one too. Good. Yes, uh, Master and Apprentice as well. Oh, that one that one was super good. Mm-hmm. That one was really good. Blood, Bloodline, okay. yes. Bloodline is the other one. Bloodline, yeah. Like she's the only she's the only author that I have bought her physical books because I love them so much. <laughs> yeah, I have Bloodline, um, and I have Lost Stars. Yeah, I was collecting them all physically. Uh, then I went went out to a friend, and he never returned it. And I was like, all right, I'm gonna stop doing this. I'm so, done. I'm done. Oh man, yeah. Uh, Azagul in the chat. What is up with all these red dice? I agree. Just pop, pop, there pop. Been some, yeah, there's been some crazy dice. So let's just double double check that we have all this updated. Nom Lom, four hull, correct. Shadowport Hunter down to six hull. Structural damage console fire. Nim. Yep. One card under the shields at five hall, four shields. Hawk, yep. untouched. Yep. Vimarati, one hall left. Oof. Yep. Pamich uh, just lost a single shield. Pamich is down two shields. Down two shields. A uh, total of one shield left or two shields left? Oh, uh, down left. one. I had it right. All right. Said it wrong. Had okay. it right. Tally's lost a single shield. And then uh The hero. Ben is <laughs> and Ben has one hall. Correct. Got it. Cool. We good. We good, we good, we good. All righty then. Well, we got ten minutes left in this game. Uh just looking at our, our time here and some of my responsibilities I do have. I don't think we're going to have time for that uh, that last game, James. But we will show off those. Uh, we'll show off those missing lists, those mystery lists that we never got to. Uh, GSP points to the person in the chat who can name what faction those two lists are. Ooh. <clears throat> have you been paying attention? Ah, that's true. You would have had. You would have had to watch. Since the beginning, mm -hmm. and remember the squads that got tossed out because they're half the squads never even got played, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's interesting. I'm pretty sure I know what it is. Mm, yeah. Well, yeah. You have the tabs open, don't you? I mean, I'm not looking. I'm not like actively <laughs> looking at it. I, I I made an honest see, honest yeah. assessment in my brain. <laughs> Let me see. I, I was writing them down, but I, uh, I think I, <laughs> I forgot after the first round. <laughs> um, hmm. I know what one of them is. Anybody out there remember? Anybody out there know? Hmm. Hmm. We haven't got a response yet out there. Nobody, nobody's yeah, jumping at the I think, bit. I think I know what both of them are. S send it on Discord. I'll tell you yes or no. 
All right. Uh... Yep. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. What a smart person I am. You're, you're a smart cookie. Actually, actually, I was like, I was like, actually, I haven't seen like these factions like at all. Yes, yes, yes. You are a smart mm. cookie. Your wife should keep you. <laughs> Five out of seven should keep. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We probably at the pace we're going up. Probably got one to two more turns left. Uh, this is still a close game, though. 50 to 26. Uh, Geraldo, as long as he doesn't lose Ben or Vi, he's still in it. Uh, he's just gotta gotta get a big strike here. Gabo, though, of course, can absolutely put the nail in the coffin if he uh, kills either of those ships. One hole on each. Just gotta hope to hope and see what happens. <laughs> They're having some trouble with the bomb dropper here. All right, they got it. <laughs> uh, yeah. The 26 to 50. Wow. Here goes Nom Lom. Man, Pamich, I, I believe in you. I want to see you just absolutely uppercut that Shadowport Hunter in the face. Let's go. Yeah, I don't think he does it unless he, like, three pinks right. I believe it. Even then, the Shadow 400 can just 5k. Gosh, those things can, can zoom. These things can really move. Yeah. So one straight. It's going for a block there. Oh, it didn't bump. Oh, he 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 did 5k, by the way. Oh, on we the already, Shadow 400? We, are, we already know, yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. Sad. And Tally Set. did a five straight. Set for Vi. Five Kizzle. <clears throat> yeah, that Shadowport Hunter literally one v three during like like his entire list basically. Yeah. <laughs> it's like I got I got this. <laughs> I mean, he's been making the right moves with it. Then yeah, put it, put it really in the right has. spot. Do what you got to do. He made a couple of good calls on actions as well. Oh, by the way, before we log off today, I want to ask you guys about your your turkey preparation plans because I just discovered something I'd never heard of yesterday, and I'm curious if anybody here does it. We'll talk about it here in about 15 minutes, maybe less. All right. One straight. He was hoping for the block so that he can get that advanced proton torpedo off. Not going to happen. He needed to turn in just a little bit sooner with that resistance transport in order to uh, to get it. He's sad boy now. It's very sad. Hmm. Hard turn away. I refuse to die. Actually, I could get away with this if uh, if Gnim turned in the wrong, if turned in the wrong the direction. Yeah, wrong direction. Yeah. Oh man. Or Nim no, Nim got it. Yeah. Nim got it. He's yeah. like, no, no, no. I was, no, no. I, was, I, was, I, was, I was thinking, I was like, what is the best move for Nim? I think it's just a one bank, which is like the perfect move. So, all right, cool. Because that gets him away from his bomb, and it gets him away mostly from the other bombs. And he's just going to bear roll to make sure he doesn't get by the cu their concussion. That's right. <laughs> like, no, no need to deal with all that. Five straight, facing off. Focus boost. Go bravely into the night. Um, he can honestly just target lock. Oh, actually, never mind. He can't because Nomlum 
No, Please. don't do it, now I'm looking to turn his turret. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. All right, let's see if that concussion bomb is in range of the hawk. Uh, he's going to keep it. Oh, he's going to hold on to that one. Let the other two blow. Got it. Just out of range there. Now, the scum did have quite a few toys to play with during this matchup. The resistance not quite able. I know the game's not quite over yet, but uh, I don't... Uh, he's going to use PZ um, for CO. <laughs> PZ what? <laughs> at the end of yep. the activation phase, you may choose one friendly ship at range 1 to 2. And if you do, transfer one calculate token to that ship. What is this? Another first on the stream. Gerardo, you. Gerardo, you are a hero. I've Passing never seen this card used. So we transfer the focus to Tally to set up the focus target lock focus shot. With uh, with the concussion missile, super solid. My goodness. Yeah, and that and that concussion missile will turn up the uh, face down card on Nam Lam. Mm hmm. It's not going down without a fight. He's gonna get some more points. All right. Looks like Torkel couldn't quite reach. Oh, he did. He had range three there. So initiative zero, Ben. Getting shot range one probably dies here. Just needs two hits to guarantee it. And gone. Boom, boom, boom. Ben 10. Off the table. Or sorry, Ben 10. I keep saying Ben 10. Short story. My brother uh, was super into Ben 10 fanfic for a long time. <laughs> super <laughs> random. Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> That's rough, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> He never I'll watches. He, he never watches, so he'll never he'll never know that I just outed him like that. <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> Straight disrespected him like that. That's right. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Uh, concussion missile here. Um, could could do it. Could a be good big. bit of damage. Pop pop pop. Especially since uh, Nam Lum is strained. Yeah. Oh my goodness. One agility. Mm, oh, definitely. Trail makes this right. You got target lock focus. Thank you. She says, <laughs> says my brother sounds cool. You know what? Hit, hit him up. He needs friends. I, lo I love my brother. But yeah, anyway, three hits. Focuses out. Takes two. Flip card. Concussion missile. Direct hit. A direct hit. hit. And then two more. Oh. <laughs> if if he if he had gotten all three of them, he would have killed them. I know. Oh. That's sad. So so close. Go ahead and take care of that. Town to one. Hmm. Let's see. Nam Lam turns that arc forward, saying, I will not go quietly into the night. Here we go. Oh, sorry. Oof. Damage is first. Wow. Just barely has range three on the corner. I remember uh, structural damage here. Ah, yes. Structural damage. It's only going to have two dice. Normally would have had three. One hit. Got a lock. If he remembers to use it. Target lock. One squiggle. Yeah, 
and rolling for a console fire. Not gonna get it. He's fine. <laughs> My ship's on fire, but it's cool. Marcel pointing out uh, that if he would have killed Namlam and halved the Shadowport Hunter, it would have been tied 82 to 82. Of course, that's Try not taken into account uh, by maybe dying here. Oh, right there. Yeah, you, you cursed Spoke him, Marcel. Spoke too soon. And a direct hit for insult to injury. It's payback for the direct hit on That's the right. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Needed a series of fortunate events. All right. Well, looking not at that, the, not that Marcel counts points. I, I, you know what? I was thinking it, James. You didn't, <laughs> you didn't have to bring it up, but now you did. I was thinking it too. I was like, of course, Marcel counts points for other people, but in his games, nah. Why would I do that? Called out. Called out. You don't feel a little <laughs> saucy today. Can't help it. I'm sorry. Two hits. Looking at Tally and only one. Two dice. Two hits. Oh, my God. All right. Squiggles? Got him. I was like, yeah, please don't take half on Tally as well. <laughs> oh, yeah. That'd be bad. Oh, Goss Boss Gunner. Another first. Look, Gerardo <laughs> is a hero. He's a hero. Never seen this boss trigger. After you perform a primary attack that misses your stress, if you're not stressed, take a stress and do it again. Not getting Oof. the half, though. Not getting the half. Nah, not today. I think, I think that's it. That is it. Congratulations, Gobble, winning that game 98 to 26. Let's go talk to these guys because that game was ridiculous. Yeah, comes. Hello, yeah, comes. my friends. Hello, hello, hello. So, Geraldo, I know you lost, but I want to say you did four things that have never been done. <laughs>